Hi friends, uh, hope everyone is doing fine. Uh, firstly, I'd like to thank uh, all of you for spending your precious uh, five to 10 minutes with me uh, today. Uh, today, I would like to discuss about the best uh, biological filter media according to me. Before I begin, just a disclaimer, I'm not sponsored by any company yet. I hope they sponsor me soon. So I've purchased all this product uh, using my own money and uh, I just want to share my experience uh, so that uh, my fellow uh, uh, hobbyists uh, can benefit from it. So filter media uh, are broken down into three basic uh, category, uh, mechanical filtration, biological filtration and uh, chemical filtration. By mechanical filtration, I mean uh, the ability of a filter to pull out the uh, floating particles in the water. It could be gunk, food, uneaten food, debris, uh, detritus, uh, mulm, uh, dead uh, plant matter, etc. Biological filtration, uh, which according to me is the main form of filtration that keeps your fish alive, is the ability of a filter to pull out uh, toxics like uh, ammonia, nitrite and nitrate. These uh, toxic will definitely kill your fish uh, if they are there in the water. And uh, chemical filtration is the ability of a filter media to pull out the uh, coloration like tannins, uh, medication uh, from your water. That, that, that becomes uh, chemical filtration. So in this uh, video, I'm, I, I want to address uh, what is the best filter media according to me uh, in terms of biological filtration. So why is filter media important? So filter media is important because they, the surface area in the filter media will host uh, beneficial bacteria. So uh, there are two important uh, bacteria, uh, three important bacteria that is required in a filter media. The first type of bacteria will convert ammonia, uh, eat them up, digest them and, and convert them into nitrite. Then the second form of uh, bacteria will convert uh, nitrite into nitrate. Now most of the filter media will stop here <clears throat> because we require the aerobic kind of uh, bacteria for the first two uh, process. In order to convert uh, nitrate into nitrogen gas and let it uh, go out of the water, we need uh, anaerobic bacteria which are available in places where oxygen is uh, very low. So the question is uh, what kind of uh, biological filter media is best uh, suitable for aquarist? Uh, I would categorize uh, aquarist into two categories. Uh, one Aquarius is the one that uh, follow the one inch uh, per gallon rule. Uh, if you not heard about this, uh, what this means is uh, for every gallon of water, uh, you can keep one inch of fish. That means if you have a 10 gallon uh, tank, all you can keep is uh, 10 small one inch tetra. So that is the uh, uh, inch per gallon rule. So if an Aquarius is following the inch per gallon rule, he can use any uh, type of filter media that he wants. And then there are Aquarius who like to overstock uh, their tanks like me, for example. So for such Aquarius, the regular uh, filter media might not be sufficient. So they need a more surface area to harbor more beneficial bacteria in order to, in order to clean the toxic in the water and that's the reason uh, 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 Aquarius who overstock the tank need uh, filter media of higher quality with more uh, porosity uh, uh, that can ha harbor more beneficial bacteria and according to my research uh, there are uh, different types of uh, filter media which are very very good uh, but uh, there are two uh, most popular filter media that can do a complete cycle. That, that means that can, can harbor uh, aerobic bacteria to convert ammonia to nitrite and nitrite to nitrate. And they can harbor anaerobic bacteria to convert uh, nitrate into nitrogen gas. And they do this uh, because uh, they have a, a region in the center of the, uh, the filter media uh, where water uh, flows very very slowly and this is a region where anaerobic bacteria will grow 
So according to my research, uh, uh, biohome and uh, filter uh, and the CK matrix are the two uh, popular filter media that can um, uh, uh, that that can harbor aerobic and anaerobic uh, uh, bacteria. <coughs> So this is CK matrix. Uh, yeah, I would recommend CK matrix uh, uh, or biohome. Uh, the reason is uh, the shape and size of CK matrix. It's uh, basically CK matrix is pumice rock, and it's a uh, uh, round in, in in shape, and uh, uh, it's it's easy to stock uh, in, in a in a filter, and it's easy to pile it up. Whereas biohome uh, have a different shape, and uh, also uh, the cost of uh, CK matrix is roughly uh, fifty percent compared to biohome, and biohome has a long, uh, slender shape, and that makes it uh, uh, a little bit uh, difficult to, in my opinion, to uh, to put in a canister uh, filter. And uh, by the way, uh, green aqua and uh, 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 the, the big uh, uh, plant to tank uh, channel they also use a CK matrix in fact they have uh, used a microscope and they have shown how poor CK matrix is compared to the other media uh, just to show you some of the filter media that I uh, I have uh, this is a sponge this is a with, with, with very coarse uh, uh, this is a coarse sponge with the bigger holes uh, and uh, this is a fine sponge uh, with smaller hole and they even have these kind of uh, pimples in it and this is uh, supposed to uh, harbor more beneficial bacteria so the basic form of filter media would be uh, uh, sponges and you, know, you get sponges of different color black blue pink uh, green name it then coming to uh, <coughs> filter media that can uh, harbor more uh, beneficial bacteria uh, that you can get uh, even from your nursery this is a uh, leaka balls they are very light uh, baked uh, clay uh, balls uh, have a lot of surface area very light um, you can use uh, this as well even buy uh, pumice stone from your nursery uh, CK matrix is a uh, very very uh, high quality uh, pumice rock and there are other things like the, the ceramic uh, ring which come in different colors this is white uh, these are the these are Lika balls this is uh, pumice yeah CK matrix will be uh, in, in this form yeah so that's it uh, to summarize uh, uh, Aquarius who have uh, low stock uh, who follows the inch per gallon uh, rule they can actually use any kind of uh, filter media you might have seen a lot of uh, a youtuber who has uh, a lot of tanks in their house the, they are sufficient keeping just a sponge filter and that uh, and um, uh, that would suffice and but for it uh, for aquarius who like to overstock the tank uh, they have a lot of fish a lot of bio load they they need a, a filter media of more that can harbor more beneficial bacteria and for that uh, i recommend ck matrix uh, as my first choice of uh, a biological filter media i hope you found this uh, video helpful and uh, you found the information relevant if you like uh, my video, please consider to like, subscribe and share so you can support my channel. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Happy fish keeping.